Hello everyone, today we are going to create a toggle menu prototype like this. Uh, basically when I click the left alignment button, it's going to show an icon up there and uh, when I click center aligned and when I click right aligned, uh, regardless of uh, which state of the component you are in, the toggle menu is going to switch to its active state and uh, change also the uh, content sample there. Uh, creating a toggle menu more than two items can be challenging. Uh, that's why I decided to uh, create one with three uh, items. Uh, the logic would be the same for toggle menus that has multiple uh, items. So. Uh, Let's start creating it. I uh, beforehand copied the artboard here and uh, as you see there is uh, no component in this particular artboard so uh, I'm gonna uh, create it from scratch. So uh, I'm selecting the left alignment icon here after centering, centering it and selecting uh, this button group at the bottom and with command K, uh, I'm converting them to a component. And uh, as you see, it has a default state. What I'm going to do is, uh, in default state, I'm going to uh, reduce this icon's opacity to zero to uh, start with an empty uh, start with an empty screen and uh, selecting after selecting the component i'm gonna create a new state i'm gonna name this left to indicate that it's the left aligned state uh, then what i'm going to do is uh, i'm gonna increase this icon's opacity to uh, 80 percent basically I'm creating the uh, states first and then I'm gonna do uh, define the interactions and uh, complete the prototyping. So uh, left state is uh, done. I'm gonna click uh, while left state is selected I'm gonna click plus button to create another state. The second state is going to be center and I'm going to take center uh, icon and delete this left, uh, left icon there and paste the center icon to the place and uh, repeat the process for our last state which is going to be right. What I'm going to do is I'm gonna take this right aligned icon I'm going to paste and place the exact uh, same position uh, my previous icons have so uh, when I check I define the states but I something which is also indicating the active uh, state of my component here by increasing the uh, navigation's active background uh, opacity. Uh, basically I need to make it visible uh, to, to indicate which state is active. So at left state the uh, nav active BG layer is going to be here and while I'm in center state I'm going to select that layer there since it needs to be uh, between the icons and the navigation's background uh, select it uh, can be tricky but I'm going to uh, I'm going to do that by selecting it from the layers panels on the left so uh, the center uh, navigation background, active navigation background of the center state is done. So I'm gonna 
uh, repeat that step for the right state and um, selecting the now active BG. I'm going to uh, actually let's make it visible so we can edit it better. So as I see it, uh, states of my component is done, including the uh, active navigation item background. The rest is uh, prototyping. So uh, I'm going to prototype. Actually, let's start from default state uh, to avoid any confusions. While I'm in the default state, when I click the uh, left align button, my prototype needs to go to with action type auto animate. Destination needs to be left state. When I'm in default state again, uh, and I click the center align button, my uh, prototype needs to go to center state and when I click the right alignment button needs to go to right alignment state. Uh, let's test it for default state. So yeah, uh, I see I'm uh, able to navigate to left aligned state but uh, as you see since we didn't define other two toggle options in left alignment state I'm not uh, able to navigate to those. I'm going to uh, complete those uh, while I'm in left state. I'm going to click the center button and choose the destination as center. Repeat the same process for right. So while uh, I'm in left, my prototype needs to work. Yeah, uh, but uh, we need to complete the uh, same uh, defining the interactions step for uh, every state of our component. So I'm going to select from left, uh, we completed. Uh, I'm going to select the center state. And while I'm in center, when I click left, it's to go to left. And when I click right, it needs to go to right. And one last time, we need to define the interactions for the right state. While I'm in right state, when I click the left button, it needs to go to left state. And same for the center. So I think we defined interactions for each and every state, right? So I'm selecting the artboard and with command enter uh, launching the prototype preview. Click the left, center, right. So yeah, uh, I guess we completed our toggle menu prototype.